John Maynard Keynes, a leading economist, is best known for his philosophy that governments should intervene in the economy to address immediate economic issues instead of waiting for market forces to correct them over time. He famously said, in the long run, we are all dead, emphasizing the importance of taking action in the present. This philosophy is known as Keynesian economics. Keynes believed that during times of economic downturn, the government should increase its spending to stimulate demand and create jobs. This approach, known as fiscal policy, involves increasing government expenditure and reducing taxes to boost consumer and business spending. By doing so, Keynes argued, the government could help the economy recover from recession more quickly. In addition to fiscal policy, Keynes also advocated for monetary policy as a tool for managing the economy. He argued that central banks should control interest rates and the money supply to influence investment, consumption, and inflation. By lowering interest rates and increasing the money supply, central banks can encourage borrowing and spending, thus stimulating economic growth. One of Keynes' most significant contributions to economic theory is the concept of animal spirits, which refers to the emotions and instincts that guide human behavior in the marketplace. According to Keynes, these animal spirits can drive economic decisions and lead to fluctuations in investment and consumption. As a result, he believed that government intervention was necessary to stabilize these fluctuations and prevent prolonged periods of unemployment and stagnation. While Keynesian economics has been influential in shaping government policies, it has also faced criticism. Some argue that excessive government intervention can lead to inefficiency, market distortions, and inflation. Additionally, the long-term effects of fiscal and monetary policies have been a subject of debate, with some questioning their sustainability and potential to create future economic imbalances.